So we here we are going to see the two product. One is gate wall. Second one is the delay system. Normally, gate wall is used uh, in every pipeline where you you have to control the flow. Okay, this is the gate wall uh, in uh, which we have the ULFM having the working pressure of 300 psi, and in, it is in the rising strain. So it can control the flow from the inside of the pump. So the once the flow is coming, we can control from the uh, from this wall, which go to the delay system. So now in the delay system, it is required to protect the fire where the large volume of area is required fire, to extinguish the fire. So basically, the application is like your oil, oil and gas power plant, refineries, boiler area, the commercial and residential. Now they are using the delay system. In delay system, there are three types. One is wet system, electrical, and pneumatic. Here we are going to see the performance of the this one uh, manual system, which is a wet system. Okay, so uh, once the, this is a priming line from the from the inlet, which is come to your the diaphragm system. Once the water comes from the, this point, it will close the diaphragm to the delay wall, so that the outlet of the, the line will be the dry system. So once the delay wall trigger, then only it will be allowed to go the uh, water to the, your uh, dry system so, to, the, to extinguish the fire. Now we are going to see the performance of the delay wall. I am closing the manual system this one so it will open the system to, uh, delay inside the diaphragm and it will allow all the water to go to the uh, all the dry system this is, a, this is the main function of the manual system in electrical what we will do we just <coughs> use solenoid valve over here to close the uh, or to close the system basically it will be used in close and open both the systems so once your fire will extinguish we will close this down. Okay. So automatically your pump will be uh, in the uh, reset mode. 